Hello everyone, this is Minister LT, and I'm delighted again and honored to minister another word from my Heavenly Father God. Today's message is, don't wait until it's too late to know God. Do not wait until it's too late to know God. And this message today is meant for somebody today, because a lot of guys, a lot of God kids out there is waiting to the last minute to know Him. And today is the day I believe and I declare right now in the mighty name of Jesus. Somebody going to know God today. And I don't know if it's going to be my brothers and I don't know if going to be my sisters. But I know after this message today, somebody going to get to know him today. Don't wait till it's too late, y'all. Because you, know, you don't know what tomorrow's going to bring. But if you start getting to know him today, you'll be a better person. And before I get started, I would like to take the time out to give my Heavenly Father God the thanks and praise and glory. Because he deserve it all. I want to thank you again, oh Heavenly Father God, for blessing me and all your children today for another beautiful day. Thank you for the breath that you put inside our lungs. Thank you for our eyes that we can see. Thank you for our ears that we can hear. And thank you for our mouth that we can speak to you and praise and shout out your holy name each and every day, Jesus. We just want to say this thank you today, Jesus. Because who you are and what you stand for, how great and awesome that you are, how merciful that you are. How what you did on Calvary for us. How you died on that cross for us. How you forgave for all our sins, Jesus. All we can say is say thank you. That's not enough thank yous that we can say thank you each and every day to you. Because you need to be thankful each and every day. It don't matter how many times we say it, Jesus. We just want to say thank you. We just want to say we thank you, we love you, and we honor your holy name each and every day, Jesus. We want to say thank you. Now, ladies and gentlemen, we're about to get into this word. And I would love for y'all to turn y'all Bibles to Romans chapter 12 today. And we're reading from verse 2. That's Romans chapter 12 and we're reading from verse 2. And if you have your Bibles open, ready to receive this word, shout out amen. Amen. Do not conform any longer to the pattern of this world, but be transformed by the renewing of your mind then you will be able to test and approve what God's will is. His good, pleasing, and perfect will. And that's true. Only you're going to know that. You can't wait till it's late to know God. You got to know him now to know his good, pleasing will that he had for you. And that's something that he put in. He gave every last one of his kids. But for all of you to know what his good, perfect will is to you, you got to know him. You got to build a relationship with them, y'all. And some of y'all are waiting too late to trying to figure out who God is. And today, somebody need to, need, to, need to really wake up and know who God is. And so a lot of y'all out there in this world right now are waiting to the last minute. You're pushing it off each and every day. Oh, I get to know God tomorrow. Oh, oh I, I, I get to know him next week. Oh, I get to know him next month. Oh, I get to, go, I get to know him next year. But the thing about it, you don't know if you're going to live tomorrow. You don't know if you're going to live next week. You don't know if you're going to live next month or next year. So why you keep putting it off and you can know God right now today? It don't take but a second. All you want is a little bit of your time. Each and every day. Some of you right now in the grave, in the, in the cemetery right now, didn't even have an opportunity to know God. But you're wishing that you had that one more chance to know Him. And I know some of y'all probably saying, oh, I know my loved one went to heaven. How you know that they ain't know God? You do not know that, that they're in heaven and they ain't know God. You have to know him for you order for you to get to heaven. You have to know God for order for you to get to heaven. For God, we know he, he loves us. We know that. But you have to get to know him if you want to go to that to, to that happy place. That's the key thing about it. Some of y'all right now, I see you right now with tubes running out through your mouth. You can't even speak. And wish that you had an opportunity just to know God. You wish you had that one more, that one second left out of your time or out of whatever the accident might took place. You wish that you had that. And you wish that you want to talk to God. You wish you had that opportunity to say, you know what? If I can just rewind the time back five, ten more minutes before whatever accident took place, I just really want to know God. And I just want to let everybody know today, do not wait until it's too late to know God. Get to know Him now. He's your everything. He's your best friend. He's going to guide you. He's going to lead you. He's going to direct you. He's going to mold you. He's going to bless you with everything that you need. Then you will know his, his great and perfect will that he has for you. But for order you to receive that, 
You got to get to know him. And I'm going to tell you, once you get to know God, that's going to be the best thing that you've ever done in your life, y'all. I'm telling you, trust me. And some of y'all, I was just like y'all. I was born and raised in church. But I strayed away. I strayed away. But when I heard his voice, he said his sheep know his voice. When I heard his voice, I went to him. And they got to know God on a personal level, an intimate level. And I love him. And once I start doing that, he started showing me things. He started showing me his perfect will that he had for Minister LT. And I know if he done it for me, he going to do the same thing for y'all. But the key to it, y'all, don't wait until it's too late to know him. Get to know him right now. I declare a receiver right now in the mighty name of Jesus. Somebody today is going to get to know God today. If that's you today, my sister, I want to say amen. If that's you today, my brother, I want to say amen. But get to know God today. Get to know him. Get to know him as your Lord and Savior. Get to know him that he can take care. Just don't get to know him because you want something from him. Get to know him, get to know him, get to know him because you're in love with Jesus. Get to know him. I promise you, he will take care of you. I promise you, he will lead you down the right way. I promise you, he will direct you. I promise you, he will mold you. I promise you, he will show you his great will that he had for you. And I declare right now in the mighty name of Jesus that it will be done. And today is the day somebody will get to know God as a day. I know they are. I know after somebody hit this word right here, somebody going to know who God is. Somebody going to know God is your father. He's your friend. He's your everything. He will never turn his back on you. He'll never leave you or forsake you. He will never lie to you. He loves you that much that he will take care of you. You know? He will take care of you. But get to know him. Get to know him on a friendly basis. Get to know him on an intimate basis. I guarantee you he will show you what he's going to do. Now, I'm about to close this message today. And I don't know who it is today, but I know somebody out there wondering what it feel like to know God. It's the best amazing thing in this world, y'all. I'm telling you, because you never know what tomorrow going to bring. You don't, do not wait until it's too late to know God. Get to know him right now. And I declare receiving right now in the mighty name of Jesus. Somebody's going to receive him today. And I want to shout out amen. And I never like to leave and close my broadcast but I'll leave him with a prayer. Can you please pray with me? Lord Jesus, I ask of you that come into my life to take over, to guide me, direct me, use me so I can build a relationship with you. And I believe right now in the mighty name of Jesus by y'all praying that simple little prayer that God is already working everything out in your life right now. And if you ever want to get in contact with me or leave me a comment, my YouTube channel is Withers, capital W-I-T-H-E-R-S dot L-T my Instagram, on my account is withers.lt. Leave me a comment. Just remember, don't wait until it's too late to know God. Know him now. He loves you. He's waiting on you. And I'm going to say thank you all again for always tuning in to listen to another word from Heaven Father God. Y'all stay blessed.